Hello, it's video 22, we're going to talk about an amazing and infuriating thing called regular expressions. Um, you might have heard this, particularly with Google Analytics, some people use regular expressions to help filter out things there. It's a really powerful tool, it's not easy to get your head around, it's easy to get started, to be very good at it, it takes time, it takes a lot of practice, so remember that, but by doing it, you could chop down your workload by like... 80% I think in some cases. We're going to import pandas, we're, on going to, we're also going to import import RE which is the reg, regular expressions module. We've loaded our data, we've infoed it, we've described it, we've headed it, we've shaped it. So now we know what it looks like. Just a quick resource, pythex.org will help you debug your regex kind of on the fly. So you input the data that you're, trying, you're, that you're going to be working with and then you build your regex pattern in this little console and it will show you, in fact, I'll just show you, much easier this way, there you go. You enter your text in there, you enter your regular expression there, and here is a cheat, cheat sheet, which you're definitely going to use, but it's not got all the answers, it just gives you the kind of fundamentals. So that's regular expression, how it works is it looks for a pattern and then based on what you want it to do with the pattern, we'll extract it or exclude it make sense. So let's start with our pattern. We are going to look at a pattern which I believe, if I wrote this correctly, is going to split everything by spaces. So first we need to store the pattern in a regex object, so it's regex or regex, whatever way you want to see it, re.compile pattern. And then we're going to do we're going to split on a blank space using regex. So this is similar to what we did in the previous one, but it's now using regex to do it. Uh, and we're going to use description, so we're just going to split everything on a blank space. This will take a couple of seconds to do. There you go. So it's created a list, and in the list is every word split by a space. So that's one way to use regex. You might not, you, there's far more complex. I mean, you could ask it just to look for every comma, not comma, um, double quotation mark, or everything inside a double quotation mark, which could be quite useful if you're looking for competitor quotes. But let's have another look at it, um, see, see how we can use it. So this is another really, really simple pattern. Look for all the digits in a given data set. So that's basically what that means is look for digits. Then we have to compile the pattern and create a regex module module object and then we're going to apply it using the lambda function again and we're going to go find all numbers and it'll go away and it's only going to give us a head because if it asks it to give us all of it it will take even longer than it's going to take there you go it creates lists of what of the numbers that were in the description text quite useful maybe you want to strip those numbers out so you build a regex pattern that removes those or it doesn't include them when you're grabbing the text so that's a very simple example of what regex is, or regular expressions. It's much bigger than this. A whole course could be built on it. In fact, I'm sure whole courses have been built on regular expressions. Um, but this is just to give you a taste, to get you put it on your, your radar so you know it's something that you can use, just another tool to help make your life easier. All right, if you liked this video, hit that like button. Comments or queries, stick them in the comments. If you want to support the channel, hit subscribe, please. Um, and, you know, share Data Boy with all your friends. Well, all your friends that will find it useful. The ones wanting to learn data analysis in Python. All right, I will see you for video 23, which kind of takes us almost up to the, the kind of, you know, seven day mark, seven days left. All right, see you soon. Ciao.